This is my starting point for Connecticut's High Point. It's a parking lot that is just south of the Massachusetts-Connecticut border, which is just over there, probably just in view from what we can see here. I'm gonna head north to Massachusetts. The trail will go left, hug the border more or less, and then we'll get to the south slope of Mount Frizzle right on the border with Massachusetts. And on the way, we're gonna peak one other little mountain too. That car peeking out behind the tree is in the parking lot where I parked. And then right here is the trailhead. And we're gonna head in there. This trail is marked with these red blazes. I'm about half a mile in and it's been pretty easy, slightly upward, uphill sloping here. Now it looks like we got a little bit of a climb in front of us. Not too much. You can see the edge through the brush up there, but you can see the blazes tracing the route right up this rock slope. Got to the top of this little climb. There was actually some scrambling at the top, but not too much. Nothing tough. Got a little more slightly steeper stuff. And it looks like I get to the top of whatever's in front of me here. Got a little bit of a scramble here. Thought I was near the top, but it looks like the top is to the right when I was looking to the left earlier. Oh, actually. Looks like there's a wraparound path to the side. So again, at a glance, that looks like a scramble, but there's a path off to the side here, so I'll go with that. Trail goes off in that direction. Let the blazes go here. Oh, it looks like that trail is just a little switch back around this hump. Let's go with that. Don't see any switchbacks over these, so looks like it's right up the slope. It's not too bad though. You can probably just walk without even scrambling. This is the trail you come up from. And when you see this marker on the ground, that's telling you the path to Mount Frizzle is over that way. But if you want to hit the peak of Round Mountain, you gotta go over that way. It's real close. We made it to the first peak of the day, Round Mountain. be on my way to Mount Frizzle right there and then the, the high point is somewhere over here on the left not sure where exactly come to think of it maybe it's pronounced Frizzle got another nice vantage point of Frizzle from this rock. The trail from Round Mountain has been coming down, down, down. And it looks like I might be close to the lowest point. We start going up here a bit. Looks like there might be another dip off there in the distance is the next mountain. That there appears to be the last little downhill before we start some real uphill here, climbing Mount Frisell. I'm a little over a mile in here and I'm probably doing the steepest part of the climb today. This is where I just came from. It's uh, probably on an angle not quite hitting 45 degrees, but pretty steep. Sitting down for a little water break at the top of this angle. So the path forward is less severe. The trail I came up is right there. The trail over to the high point is that way. And here is the, uh, the peak. It's a wooded peak, so not much of a view, but they do have a summit register and an ammo box. Right. Added my name to the registry. Now let's get to the high point. The high point is off to my right, but we got a view worthy picture right here that way to the high point that's the trail from Mount Frizzle summit and here's the high point got another registry so I'm gonna go ahead and get my name in there this right here appears to be the official marker 
Massachusetts, Connecticut state line. One more high point in the books. For a little snack and water break on the way back, I stopped again at Round Mountain, right here on the, on the summit, right there. And then we've got a nice little view for a quick snack break before the full trip back down to the starting point. This should be one of my last stretches of steeper downhill. Back at the trailhead here, about two and two thirds miles, about two hours back and forth to the Connecticut high point on the south slope of Mount Frizzle. And you also get to hit the peak of Mount Frizzle and Round Mountain on that trip with little tiny detours off to the sides. One more high pint. One, one more high pint. Lordy, lordy.